Yep, that's just water. All right, my loves, day two is done and I am so, so hungry. Let's get some food. Once again, it is quite late in the day and most places are kind of closed, but we are gonna find something that should still be delicious. Let's go. Revolving sushi place. It is a place that I have like wanted to go to for like such a long time. I feel like there's always a hint of nostalgia when I come in here. I mean, the sushi is never like that great, but it's, it's just the idea of being able to pick up food that's like rolling by you. This is so fun. So it looks like you can also order on this little tablet thing. I'm gonna get Okay. I am going to get some sushi. Okay. So for our first couple of dishes, we have the New Zealand salmon and the salmon belly. I am going to try the New Zealand salmon first. So hungry, you guys. Oh my god, I'm getting distracted, okay. New Zealand salmon. I mean, it's what you expect. The fish is decent, rice is a little stale. Not stale, just like, yeah, maybe stale. But it tastes really good. And now we have the salmon belly. Surprisingly, I like the New Zealand salmon a little more. Ooh. Up next, we have some escalar. Ooh, yes, sir. And here is some premium yellowtail. This looks good. All right, first bite of the Escalar. I don't think I like that. A little too fishy for me. Take some rice out of it because we don't need the carbs. Mm. <laughs> On to the premium yellowtail. Cash mm. guard. Premium yellowtail. Ooh. Get another of this New Zealand salmon. Mm -hmm. I like that. The food just never stops. I am so happy right now. Like a kid at a candy store. I am a fan of these New Zealand salmon. I think I took the last one that was up here. I might order some more later. Alright, let's see if there's anything else from the kitchen that we would like. Oh my god. You can get a filet mignon and a grilled black pot. I feel like I want that. Oh wait, they have ribeye too. Oh, fuck, I might get the ribeye. Oh, I am gonna get a side of miso soup as well. Oh, and the good wasabi too. I have a lot of stuff from the kitchen that's on its way. But in the meantime, why don't we get some more food? And here is the last order. We have Toro for $2.50 a piece. Snow crab, I think that's $1.99. Uni, $1.99 as well. I could be wrong. Sweet shrimp and yellowtail truffle, I think. Hmm. What do we try first? Let's go for the snow crab first. Forget the rice and just eat this. Dip it in some of that wasabi, some soy sauce. That's like a legit piece of crab. Would recommend, very good. Up next is the uni. It is very, very decent. Like it's like good. Like I was expecting fishier and like less creamy, but 
I like that a lot. Up next, the Toro. Thank you. Some miso soup came along the way. Now this is super watered down. It's actually disgusting. I, I just taste water. Yeah, that's just water. Yeah, this I think is truffle, truffle yellowtail. And that's actually a brie yellowtail. It's fish where the top layer has been scorched by a flame. Super delicious. Sweet shrimp. That's just okay. Seared Cajun albacore. Honestly sounds a little weird, but let's give it a shot. This thing is heavy in Cajun seasoning. And I'm not upset about it. Oh. All right, the next and final dish of the evening is this grilled black cod. And for $15, that is a absolute steal. Yeah, that's really good. Look at that fish. Mm. It is literally so like fatty and oily. And I love the taste of cod. Oh. Honestly, best thing of the night so far. That and the $2 Toro. I like those. I feel like I've tried everything I wanted to try. Hello there. Like it definitely scratched that itch for sushi. Definitely some good pieces. Um, pricing is very good. So I don't know if I want to eat anything else. 